You was good. <laughs> I don't know. Let's go to. I don't know. What are you doing right now? Wait, hold on. You gonna do that to me? All right, talk to you. What do you? What's good? What you do? What you doing right now? Wait, I can't hear you. Hold on. What'd you say? What are you doing right now? Oh, I'm in a um, bar, no bar on Nostrum. Oh, is that that new one? It's sort of new. Oh, wait, hold on. I got to go by. Welcome back to 20 Minutes of Fire. This is Eric Spira. Julian G. And today our guest is Brian Yang. Hey, thanks for having me, guys. Yeah, You know course. this, you know this. Uh, so, Julian, who is that on the phone that we just talked to? Oh, that was my cousin. Um, I kind of consider him one of my best friends on the low. <laughs> <laughs> Why on the low? Yeah. Because <laughs> um, I have, I don't know. He's one of my best friends. Is, is there any part of you that's like I he just texted to me yo come by doing trivia <laughs> <laughs> you guys sounded close though yeah, yeah that's my guy okay so not bad that's my guy i love him i used to live with him yeah yeah want to know how i could tell you were close neither of you were like so how's your mom like you just, you just ask a question about a different family member to that's, avoid talking about true. the two of you when you're not close oh yeah we're close oh nice. that's my guy that's my guy, oh, that's your guy? jeremy ozeal shout outs oh, okay <laughs> so, <laughs> all right so uh who is our sponsor for this week oh yeah our sponsor the one who paid us um that is this week it is bergen batting center in three newbridge road river edge new jersey um, they are, they have, obviously they sell a lot of, um, like little league batting type stuff and, and baseball gear. Nice, nice. Um, but also too, like, uh, I know a lot of like, um, little league teams, they'll actually go there for their batting practice cause they have a great, um, fast pitch, slow pitch, all the speeds, all the speeds, um, of the pitching softball and baseball, softball and baseball equipment. Uh, nice. Okay. But the batting cages are just, no, they're for both. No. They have no, you didn't, don't know me. You, they didn't contact That's you. so great that you guys get out there and get all these sponsors to support, you know? Yeah. You'd be amazed. It's not that expensive. It's the thing of people just don't ask. Like, you guys are the ones who actually go out and ask. People are just like, oh, I don't know about getting sponsors. But if you do the groundwork and call people. Usually you're you know right. I mean? Usually you're right. But these guys actually contacted <laughs> us. <laughs> oh, yeah. shit. Yeah. These guys actually contacted us. They said, you know what? We, hear, we, we can tell what kind of listeners you have. Uh-huh. We can tell a lot of them have kids in... Jersey. River Edge, New Jersey specifically. Right. Mm-hmm. And we need that shout out. Yeah, so if you, you if you want to sponsor, just email 20firemen at gmail.com. Hit us up. Let us know. Love to have I'm, you on. And That's honestly, dope. if you're trying to go batting, holler at us. Let's yeah. go to let's go to it's not that far from the city. Yeah, let's Julian's go. got a car. Let's go. Oh, you got a car? Let's go. Let's go. Let's, let's go. hit some balls. They're closed right now though. Yeah, yeah it's a little tomorrow, late. Tomorrow. But well, you can't control it. All right, so uh, Julian's cut. What was his name again? Sorry, uh, Jeremy Ozeal. Oh, Jer- Jeremy Ozeal uh, gave us the topic of bars, so uh, I think we should just get right into this. What are we waiting for? Are either of you sober? Oh, what? is that? All right, there we oh, go. sober Start. in general. Yeah. In like, no, no, no. All right, cool. I drink. Cool. Yeah, I drink. Me Let's keep this topic. Yeah. I know. Well, it is crazy though. I do know. Se- I feel like in the city, people are sober or kind of on the alcoholic. Level. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Not okay, many. you're good though. I, I, that's my problem though. I feel like I'm a very in betweener, and so I have trouble finding girls to go out with because there's not many other in betweeners. True. I oh, know so you. you know when you when to cut it off. Well, I've Is seen her just saying? just just ha- like go or to go one hard. drink minimums, buy them and give them the, give them women. Like you won't even have the one you just purchased. Oh, it's like that. Oh, I did that. My, I wasn't in the mood for. I've a seen beer, multiple times. But don't I'm like, act. listen, not trying to spend four dollars on a soda. That's a waste. Just drink the one beer. I didn't, I didn't want it. I didn't need it. You're like Mother that. Teresa. Well, you know what? I see other people having a good time. I'm like, let me make their time even uh, more fun. I'll do that, though. It's like, you know, we get paid in drink tickets so often at yeah. shows. I'll just give away drink tickets. It's nothing to me. Oh, see, I never You know, drink that. tickets <laughs> is nothing to me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You, you yeah. get a drink ticket. Yeah. I could make it rain in drink <laughs> tickets if I wanted to. You know how many drink tickets I have back at yeah. the house? Yeah. Well, it's just like we're out every night. Like, we could drink every night if we wanted to. That's part of the job. If we wanted to. Yeah, Not but even I comedy, think. Just the city. Yeah, just living in New York. Driving. Yeah, any you urban are. city. We aren't. Yeah, Julian, watch it. The anyway. sad thing is, I'm driving a lot of time and I think I'm drinking more than. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> 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 what were you saying, though? We middle. can drink every night. We I could drink every but we have the responsibility to know that you got to cut it off. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's a nighttime business that we're in. 
Yeah. And we get paid in alcohol. Like, if you have a good set, oh, here's alcohol. That's because true. we appreciate your comedy. You know what I mean? It's true. the one job where it's like, here's a poison to <laughs> show our appreciation. Or it's even when they give you, like, happy hour prices. Oh, yeah. And it's like nothing. Oh, right. Yeah. But that's uh, it's just crazy how I'll see. I've seen people do a spot at, like, a club. And they, they have a tab. And then they literally get, like, $20. And then they give more than half of that right back. Oh, yeah, <laughs> you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? Like, it's just... Yeah, yeah. It's true. It's like when you work at Macy's, you spend your whole paycheck right. at Macy's. Yeah. That's what well, co- comedians this, are doing. I've been in all these situations. <laughs> all <laughs> all these, terrible. Not that's Macy's a, specific. Right. But in that. Retail industry. I've been industry. in the, the buying a lot of drinks at the bar when I'm doing the show. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Well, all you need is, like, a, a little... A few jokes to go well, and you feel like big baller, like I'm buying everybody drinks. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm buying shit for anyone else. But. Well, feel, yeah, or I feel now I started running a show, and they obviously want people to buy drinks. Uh-huh. So True. now, you always every buy. time I go to a show, I at least buy one. Right, right. Just of course. To be like, Just to support your yeah. own mic. Right, right. Not the mic. Not the mic. Show I'm Shows. at. Show I'm at. Show right? I'm at. Don't don't demand. We'll it's not a we'll mic. It. All right. <laughs> bleep out. It's bleep out, Mike. <laughs> it's a show. Yeah. To support your own show. Well, it's funny <laughs> that I don't have that mentality towards mics at all. I'm not like, oh, thanks yeah. for having me at this mic. I'll buy a drink, support your bar. <laughs> I'm like, I came to this mic because it was free. So I'll get a water. You're part maybe of the problem. Dollar. Okay, that's not a problem. Hey, should be you nice. finish my fault. We're we're one of the few breeds of people that are in bars every night, though. That's true. Like, I'm in a bar every single night of the week. It's I don't insane. Hate it. It's not bad. Like you grow to like things. I like I like this smell a bar you know how some bars smell a little mildewy oh, yeah. like a little You're wet for it. some reason can't get enough i don't like the smell of that <laughs> not mad at it you. reminds me of comedy it reminds me of good times i feel that <laughs> you know what i mean yeah, yeah. absolutely. It reminds me to work hard <laughs> <laughs> yeah if, so if i quit <laughs> tomorrow which i might um <laughs> And I like go back to one of these same bars twenty years, and I'm just gonna smell that. You're absolutely right. And you'll go right back to that time, right? You'll exactly. be like right, right back like, oh in comedy, God, like when I was wasting my whole time doing. Right, that. right, right. Yeah. No, have you ever? Uh, there's a for those of you who don't know, there's a bar in the city called Karma, and it's one of the only bars. Oh, actually, that one, I, that one I can't fuck with. That. But what's smell. interesting is that it doesn't smell like a smoke smoke. It has this like specific. It's a sweet smoke. smoke. Hookah, yeah. Sweet smell, but it's one that like I remember I left there once and I saw someone gave him a hug and they just were like, "Oh, you were at Karma." Like the it's That's this a distinct. Bad look. That's a bad look. Smell. Yeah. That place. Yeah, I would. Yeah, if I quit, I wouldn't. I don't think I'd miss that smell. No, that no. that's terrible. Yeah, no. I think that's more because it's run by Middle Eastern people. No disrespect, you know. <laughs> I mean, it is no a disrespect. Place, yeah, you know? no disrespect when Middle Eastern people smell. So. Yeah, it's just widely uh, known, you know. I didn't co-sign, <laughs> <laughs> but I was, uh, that was a joke. karma does think. Yes, yeah, karma does. I, I, I don't know if it's owned by Middle East. I think it's owned by Asians, actually. Oh, then Possibly. I get that. Yeah, and I'm Asian. Then so I get that. Yeah, yeah. I co-sign that. Yeah, but hookahs are a big deal in Middle Eastern culture. That's like Very true. They're, uh, I don't know. I feel like white people. What is it like? You got a big mantle, fireplace, big family photo. Oh, that's Middle there. Easterns. You walk in giant hookah right giant on the hookah. table, right? And Especially that's like those their Israelis. measure of wealth. Yeah, there you go. Or Lebanese, actually. Lebanese as well. I've heard. Leban- yeah. Le- but today the I Leban- found that out. <laughs> 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 right. I, d- I can see it, though. Inventing I can slurs. see it. There we go. 20 minutes of <laughs> <laughs> What was the theme again? Hating <laughs> people from the Middle East? I think yeah. that's okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. That yeah. was it, I believe. <laughs> I don't know. I, uh, what, what to you, though, in general, makes a good bar? What about... No, you go first. Uh, okay. That's Straight it. up, it has... To, to me, I don't like fancy bars. It's got to be shitty... Like, I love bars where there's no one there, and, like, it's just shitty. The drinks are cheap. Um, That's essential. It's got that mildewy smell that I talked about. I just love mildew. I'm all, I'm all about mildew. You do know? You, do you agree with this, though? Because, like, when I heard that, I half was like, sounds like a dude has been in a long relationship. He's like, I don't, <laughs> that yeah. He's like, I don't care if I walk in. I don't want any there. temptation. No, yeah. no, it's I not even temptation. No women. Like, I don't like, I don't <laughs> yeah. even. I don't like, like, she's like, listening. It's yeah. not about temptation. <laughs> it's a, no, uh. I understand, like, you guys are both single, correct? Yeah. Okay, so, yeah, you yeah, want to out here. You guys want to go to, like, the cool <laughs> hip bar, because that's where the good-looking people are. But, no, no, I, I agree with, no, no, no. But if like you're just, shit. I don't like, like me, the cool I, hip bar, but I have out, different standards. Yeah. Gotcha. If I'm going out, I'm just going out to drink, right? Because I, I got a girl. I feel you. So, I just need I a place you. that has beer, and I'm good. Personally, cheap beers are, like, I don't like that fancy new shit. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. like that shit. But, essential, the jammers. Oh, the music. Oh, okay. okay. The okay. jammers. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Thank you for translating. Yeah. Uh-huh. The j- <laughs> that's, my, that's the only reason I'm on this podcast. <laughs> <The> j- <laughs> Translate Julian. Yeah, the- <laughs> Jam- <laughs> Is it bad jammers? that I can speak his language? Uh, yeah. j- jammers, cheap drinks, mm-hmm. good ratio, always a plus. Okay. But sometimes you are just going out to have fun. You're not going to scoop. But it's nice. You know what I mean? to have. Where do you go to scoop? Like, See, I'm six years in a relationship. I have no idea 
where you go. I want to say I go to the bar exclusively to scoop. Would you go to a club? No, I don't like clubs. Okay. I'm not See, I hate clubs. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. Can't do it, I hate clubs. No. I'll go. I mean, once in a while, but I'm talking. I like the ones that are like dancing optional. Like there's oh, yeah. a good uh, dancing area. Yes. Remember that time yes, we were out with everyone. Mike Koss? Oh, Mike Koss, who can't dance? Yeah, he yes. can't dance. <laughs> yes, yes. But me and Erica were killing it. But it was good for him because the then he didn't have to come into and the And he got to see area. two cool cool kids doing yeah. their thing. You guys look like you have good dance chemistry. For sure. We was out here. Okay. All right. Well, part of it's knowing the music. That's true. Oh. You never, you have you ever, I've been in dance situations where it's like, all right, not a Taylor Swift fan, right? But like, oh, whatever. So you can't really dance to Taylor Swift, can yeah, you? You'd be, you, you'd be surprised. I went to a very white college oh. and people made it happen, but. They'll, they'll figure it out. I feel like it's a lot of shoulders. Well, there's a way, there's a way. Uh, yeah. White but, people But music. the worst is when you're out there trying to pretend to be into it and everyone uh. else is singing the words and you have no clue. Yeah. Don't you, I, that makes me feel left out. Yeah, More than like right. if I couldn't dance. That's how I feel like EDM shit. Oh, oh man! Oh, when I hear that shit, I'm just like, why are? How why do, do they you? know that? And how can yeah. they differentiate this That's from some other shit? Yeah, me. and the beat changes too much. I can handle it for two songs. Two songs, I'm like, right, I'm into it. And third, I'm like, this is still happening. Yeah. <laughs> it's brutal music. Like, too. put on Queen Bay again. <laughs> for those <laughs> who can't tell, me and Erica just slapped high five. Yes. <laughs> for those at home. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I. It's weird. I like the combination of not too many people there because, like, then when you want to drink, it's easy to get one. Uh-huh. But, but enough people. Yeah. yeah. Or kind of like those deadish bars. You're so down for the start of the night. Okay. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially, like, you just meet your friends. You're kind of chatting. You're for like, sure. whatever. You're not in the bothersome, you know, mode. Yeah. And then the mid place is that mid crowded, whatever. Yeah. You're like, okay, there's other people here. Some nice music, blah, blah, blah. And then, if anything, maybe I'll go to that, like, ultimate dancing at club At the end of the night? Pl- yeah. See, but what I like, like to do is when you're start burnt out. at the shitty place. Yeah. And then trick people into just staying. Like, guys, we're in here. We got a great <laughs> spot. <laughs> Why would we go? Yeah, I'm the tricker. I'm the, I'm <laughs> you're the, the fucking, trick friend. Yeah, I'm the trick And then, friend. The, and then also, you're yeah. that friend who I'm like, wait, it's four? What the yeah, fuck? Yeah, yeah. All oh. of a sudden. We never we never left the show. No, we just sat at the end of the bar all I night. I was talking to him about third grade teacher yeah, all day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. But the trick friend has to be great at conversing because you don't even notice. Exactly. They have to be a good time. I feel like I have more of those than with it, friends. Oh, for sure. Yeah. With it, like, hip like with the movement gotcha gotcha oh yeah like julian's w- all like about w- the movement like w- no no just like like just like going like just, i don't know having a good time but i've but i've been the trick friend before i've been that person that's like i just want to we're already here you. i've been there too especially if someone's trying to go a train ride somewhere else i'm like nah. oh no, I yeah, yeah. Fuck I that. That. Or the, but i mean uh, once you're drinking like i'll throw down 40 dollars for a cab if i'm drunk yeah, of I'm course like, oh it. yeah that's you know? Yeah. Of course. Just That's need a little struggles. alcohol in my bloodstream, and then I'm just like Jay Z. Like, yeah, I'm taking a cab everywhere. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> or you just. I'm not checking my bank account. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 don't, <laughs> yeah, don't check your bank you account. you justify the cab ride with someone else with you. Yeah, like, yeah. All you need is find one person that's kind of on the way. You're like, nice cab. We're in. Sure. <laughs> well, I mean, on a night out, I mean, if it's past 12, I mean, one wrong train and your whole night's done. Oh, yeah. Oh, for sure. Sh- yeah. You know, you're waiting for one thing. Someone happened to do suicide, which would be horrible. Right. But your night's done. Oh no! So you in the tracks. You moved to the city with a girlfriend, correct? Yeah. Right. Look, this is why like my taste in bars is so shitty. Like I'm, not I'm, that, I'm living the life of a forty year old man. I got a girlfriend. We got a dog. Ooh, we what kind? A uh, little terrier. <laughs> like she's those. a mutt. Though. No, she's I love from, those. She's from the pound. You know, she was free. Um, I like the small one. I love yeah, those. she's good. Uh, but like, uh, man, I, I'm so I'm so tired and lazy, you know, because I'm sure just man. in it. You know, I'm in it. I got the life of an old man. So like my my level of bar that I like is so much lower than I think what you guys that makes perfect sense be to into, you know But I mean? you've never had to experience the because like when you're taking someone home from a bar, oh, uh, like the, the th- there's often this like one? long train ride, oh, gotcha. and that's to me like you got a cabin. I'm you telling taking you, though, home some, train people, dudes? some people take trains. <laughs> Dude, okay, like, if you're like okay, yeah, that, like, you scoop something from the bar, you got it. You See, got I'm, a cabin. I'm so far outside me? of the game. So you, losers. you you meet a guy at the bar. I'm saying that's hard. You got to keep that convo the whole train. That's ride. insane. That's yeah. why so they're you, supposed to pull you into oh a train. That's not I mean into a cab. That's not your fault. Yeah, that's, that's not, not the guy. That's, that's, the, guy. that's the guy's fault. Yeah, yeah holy me, shit. Dad, okay, not me. You get you get totally scooped by whack losers. Yeah, so you're at you're <laughs> you're at some hip bar in Manhattan. No, we're not even talking hip bar. Okay, you're somewhere in Manhattan at a bar. You meet a dude, you guys hit it off, and then you just take an hour train. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking you about? I'm, no, I'm saying to you, you've never had I've never. Yeah, that's great. But I'm talking about you guys. Have you done? That's insane. I'm because like, like okay, let's in do the bar you're on, right? There's music, you're drunk, well, everyone's you having fun. It. You know what I mean? 
God in the God. bar, you're Don Draper because like the lights are low. You're looking good. Everyone has alcohol in their system. You get in the train. I feel like the lights are bright. You're automatically like ten times more sober. You know what I mean? And then uh, I don't know. You're like, holy shit. How do I talk to this person? Wait. So you, Julian, you've never taken someone home from a bar and hopped a train with them, even if it was no transfers, whatever, like four train stops. Listen. It sounds so dirty. That's even cheaper. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, there's no way. And if I like scoop something from a bar that night, there's no way in hell I'm taking on a train. Your cabinet, right? If we go on like a, if we like meet up another day, you know what I mean? Then I'll, yeah, then okay. I have no problem train, but like that night. Oh, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, that's crazy. No. I've only done I've only done it once, but it was fine because it was like it was almost like a nap period. <laughs> oh, you guys just quit talking? <laughs> and then you woke up and you started back up. <laughs> it's also different. Though. I will say no, this though: it's like also different group with a group. You know what I mean? If you got not like with the group. no, no saying, what I'm, I'm saying like like okay. three people, like three like you and your. I'm not saying like I do something. Time. You know, what I'm just saying though, like right, if you're right. like with some boys and like you meet up with some girls and then you guys are gonna head to someone's crib or another place, then you can hop on the train all together. Yeah, got, but like, that nice would be group. better. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Maybe you yeah. just got to have a really good friend who's like down at ride trains with you to make stuff not, not awkward. You know but then I mean? they need a friend too. You can't just be like fucking two. Oh, yeah. Then it's creepy, right? <laughs> the extra. Double team in the room. <laughs> <That'll be extra laughs> that, that's true. Yeah. Too smart know. for this world. <laughs> Too smart. What is, uh, what is your guys' go-to drink then? Are you both beer men? Yeah, beer. I'll do, yeah, an IPA or... Uh, Dirty Martini, if I'm feeling Ooh, fancy. Oh, I see you, okay. Mad yeah, Men over yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. But is, is that like the the one that's like clear? I don't even know what that means. No, it's cloudier. Like there's more uh. olive juice. Oh, there's like, more yeah, olive yeah, juice. Yeah, that's yeah. okay. I get that makes sense. That's why mm-hmm. it's so dirty. Okay. Yeah. I'm just I'm just the uh, cheapest beer, please. One oh, of, one of the cheapest beers. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the cheaper Always? one. <laughs> yeah, quantity over quality. Keystone Light. Quantity. Well, it's not even the quality. It's kind of like the quickness factor. You never like, or do you do the beer shot combo? Is that no? Because like honestly, I don't really like shots, and I drink a lot. <laughs> so like, if I'm having 15 beers in a night, I can't be having like 15 IPAs. You know, you seem like you'd be a shot guy. I I can picture you'd be yeah, like, yeah. I'm buying everybody shots I'm tonight. A, I'm a Bud Light guy. Bud Light, got you. See, about you? Or beer. PBR or PBR. I'm not a beer drinker, but I'm also not a shot person. Ugh, I hate Cocktails. That. Uh, uh, I like. Uh, I think I've found the figure. I like uh, whiskey gingers in the winter. Those are good. I like <laughs> gin and gingers in the summer. I see you. All right. I'm not I, mad at uh, that. When I when I realized ginger ale is a mixer, I was like, why didn't I do this always? Uh, like I, I was like, there's no yeah. other. There's no, no I'm better. far from mad at that. That's good. Yeah. I don't. Know. Yeah. Those are good. I just. Uh, I totally forgot. What, oh. Yeah, with the shots. When someone's like, "We got shots," and they go and hand me one, I'm like, oh. I literally am like upset. I hate. At them. I'm like, I'm mad. But like, I'm I, like, take I take it. I take it. Yeah. I'm literally like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, you know, I don't like shots. It's I got a little. Thing. Um, you don't have a little douchebag in you. I got a little douchebag in me. Like, I'll do like Irish car bombs or fucking. Those uh, are better than just a straight shot, I mean? honestly. Oh, that's like. I feel like. Yeah, if there's bombs. a night that I'm drinking, then suddenly I'm like down for whatever. Oh, but I would never do that. But myself. other nights I'm like, I got. Oh, really? I've been known to just buy a round of Jaeger bombs. So yeah, to be honest with you, yeah, that's no. just a nice guy. Mode. It's super fun though. Like those are fun. No, those it's are super fun. fun. Those are fun because you get really drunk, and then everyone's like, "Remember when we did Jaeger bombs last yeah. night?" Yeah, it's a good story. But the thing is, like you said, in like the dumpy bars where no one's around, way more likely to do that. Yeah, crowded bar. If someone, that's why that's I, do what that. I don't. I think that's what I don't like about the shots. Is like the, I'm like everyone's li- fucking all right. Like you know what? I feel like that stereotypical 23 year old girl, and I hate that. <laughs> I feel you. Like I'm like, ugh, I gotta like because you can't. Sip, you gotta like take it like you know, thrust yeah. head back. Oh, gotcha. there's no yeah. not annoying way. Yeah. To you can do it. Here's how you do it. What? You just pound it back and then put the shot glass on the table upside down. Just in a little bit. That's then bad. So that way you don't have to. Wait, what? It's just bad because like oh, just to look. Erica cool. doesn't want to oh, look. So you're not like she doesn't want to look like a 23 year old. So you look like, like a cool guy. Yeah, you just like take and then boom, slam it, slam it upside down. It looks a little cooler. And you don't look like a stereotypical so twenty three year old. Twenty three year old stereotypical is just like you take it, you uh, pound it, and it's like ah, oh, it's so strong. And then you like raise it in the air. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. What's so well, even it's like? What was that? That's the other one. Like, what was that? Vodka? I think that I think the moment I feel that most like uh, is when everyone does the cheers of the shot before taking oh, it together. Yeah. I'm like, uh, but I what mean, about like like the four cool guys? Like, oh, cheers, dude. Or is, or do you like the? Are you talking about the? Ah. Yeah, I don't know. People it at home can't see like my arms. It's an but event but for no <laughs> reason. How about? The, you can make you it. Do a little cheer, though. You, you can make it so cheer. much cooler. Just pound the shot on the table, and then take the shot, and then put it upside down. You look, you look awesome. 
There's nothing Never done that, about but I'll know that. No, that should be that's that should cool. be your shot thing. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. It's just crazy how if even if I'm drinking a whiskey ginger and someone buys whiskey shots, I'm like, oh, you can't fuck with that. Yeah. So sometimes I'll cheat. I'll just dump it in my drink. I'm like, well, this is a double. I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel that. that I can't sense. do the vodka shots. I'll immediately. No, puke. I I OD'd on that in high school. It's over for me. OD. Just I plastic never done handles it. I did of vodka. Because oh, yeah. you know how when you're in high school and you first start drinking, like you don't really know <laughs> how powerful things are. No. Oh, you have like no I would, idea. Yeah. I would just have like a water bottle of vodka. And be like, yes, yeah, probably a night. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, what's the chaser? Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Like, uh, but now, like now, I oh, see Jesus. and I know what it is. Yeah. And first like, time I got drunk. Yeah, no. Like, sophomore year high school, me and my buddy split a just me and one other guy split a fifth of um, Captain Morgan. Just two people. Oh, first time? You don't, you oh don't, yeah, God. you don't know. You'll be done after four, though. Yeah, you don't know time. the strength of, you don't know the strength, the strength of alcohol. That's and why we Lucas like, get in trouble. We feel so cool. Yeah. Yeah, next morning we were fucked. It was terrible. Yeah, of course. Mm. Yeah. That's, I didn't, I actually never experienced like a hangover, hangover till senior year of college. Oh, oh really? what? Wow. That yeah. makes no sense. Because I me. was, because I quickly learned that I did not, I do not have the stomach to drink. Mm. So like if I hit that point where I started to black out, brown out, I was going to puke. You were an athlete too, though. In high that makes school, sense. Right? Too, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you have, you have um, discipline. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, yeah. When were you know, you, there's certain uh, you can't do well, it. You know, you got yeah, practice yeah, next yeah, day. Yeah. I get it. Were you an athlete in high school or anything? I mean, I played, but, but I stopped by by twelfth grade okay. quickly. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, I mean, other I things were much more important <laughs> right. to me. See, I don't see. Yeah. It. I think I think the bad thing that comes to the athlete is it's very like when you're in, you got like you have that all in mentality. Uh-huh. So on nights when I'm like, we're drinking, I'm like. Drinking. Oh, Michael Jordan. So that's why a lot of times people are like, oh, I see you like not ever drink. And I'm like, meh. But it's because sometimes there's nights where it's like, that got bad. Yeah. That's true. Gotcha. But yeah, I don't know. It's a combo. Double edged sword. Which What's is weird. With the team thing, you think I would love the group shots. But I yeah. don't. I'm like, ugh. I see drinking as an individual sport. <laughs> it's, <laughs> more, it's more baseball. I have my techniques. You. you have yeah, yours. Yeah. Whatever works. Yeah, don't push yours on me. Do you guys remember the hardest you ever blacked out in a bar? Just like night over, you fucked up some friendships. Um, well, fucked up ooh. friendships. I mean, definitely be college. I for mean, me. I, got oh, a couple, yeah. I have a couple. Because we do, we do a that, senior week. That was screwed up from alcohol. What was yeah. like relationships? Oh, uh, maybe not relationships. Okay. More like uh, my own um, reputations. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. More so than friendships. Yeah, yeah I feel like it would always be that. It'd be more people were telling you just like embarrassing shit. Yeah, you did. I would just more be embar- I've had like nights though where like I remember one night uh-huh. I legit woke up it, like my I lived on the third floor of this house, right? Okay. It was like a five person house. My buddy lived on the downstairs, and I remember I woke up in his bed because he's on the downstairs. Uh-huh. So they just like put me there, I guess, you know. And he slept in my bed, and I remember waking up and be like, "Damn, I missed the night." I remember waking up like I must have <laughs> took a nap at like, so, and I'm like why did I nap in Chris's bed <laughs> you know and then I get up and I'm just like nah I, remember I did something last night my uh, folks like yo Jules you alive <laughs> that reminds me of mine we did a gin bucket it was like one of the first weekends of senior year and it was at our house and then we went to like this tent party for Halloween and I don't remember this but I was sprinting back and forth between like the tent yeah. and oh, the house to yeah. refill my cup. Yeah. Like because the next day my legs were killing me uh-huh. and they were like, "Yo, you were li- you literally would be like, "Oh, I need a refill and just take off." That's drunk. And then came yeah. back. That's that drunk shit. Yeah. That's that drunk and then I passed out in like face front my friend's bed and she was uh, she was she was with her girlfriend actually. I just like walked in. Oh, timer. Oh, well, that's that story has to end. <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah. we're going to miss out on Erica and, and no, two girls. No literally, uh, no, literally what happened was I walked in and they looked at me and I was just hammered and I just said gym bucket and then I just fell in the bed <laughs> and just knocked out. But it was the thing if I woke up, they weren't there. And I was like, why did I sleep in Jamie's bed? <laughs> Imagine you here? woke up with all and you was like, wait, well, I was really drunk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, sure. It doesn't matter. Um, all right. So I guess that's our 20 minutes of fire for you this week. Go ahead, go ahead. Awesome. Any, anything you... Uh, Want to plug anything you got going on? Uh, I I host a show at Beauty Bar every Tuesday at nine o'clock. Come check it out. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, and what's your on. Twitter handle? At Brian Yang, B R Y A N Y A N G. Um, check it out. I just want to thank uh Bergen Batting Cages again. They yeah, the thank best. you seriously. Yeah. Oh Thanks. yeah, for making all this possible. We yeah. gotta we gotta check it out. Yeah, they paid for my Uber out here. It was great. Yeah. yeah. Oh, just celeb kind status. People. Celeb status. Yeah. Of forgot which part but uh, jersey <laughs> in general it's actually riverside um, i wanted to say ridgewood that's why i was knew it was gonna no no it it's neither of those it's actually um <laughs> it's over <laughs> 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 it's done. all right all right thanks guys
Uh, we'll see you next week. Peace. Keep oh, yeah, bye. Bye, bye, everybody. <laughs>